you taste this food, it almost seems as if your mom was in the kitchen, or your aunt was in the kitchen, or someone, you know, or, or maybe your dad, if he's the cook, he was in the kitchen, but it's home cooked food. People look at it and say, you know what, someone put their, their love into this dish. For over 25 years, Bobby Ford has been giving back to his community by working as a police officer. However, in 2016, he decided to pursue another one of his passions, cooking, by opening Bobby Q's. Cooking has always been a passion. I mean, I used to help my mom uh, in the kitchen when I was six years old. And um, it, it wasn't by choice initially. <laughs> My belief is soul food is international, so you have to just subscribe to the nuances of the Italian influence, you know, the Korean influence, the Chinese influence, you know, the American influence. It's just so many di different things that go into what makes their food soul food and what makes my food soul food. When you put this uniform on, you know, there are people that you represent, there are people that look up to you. There are many people that welcome you. Again, this is why I put roots here and open, you know, this restaurant. It's like, why not invest in your own community? You've opened up a business in the area in which you live and which you work. So you know, people appreciate that. I think that in the way of people getting together, people working together, I think there's, we, we've come a long way. And I think we, we're gonna keep going a long way. You are the person that you are uh, before you become a police officer. These here, this is our barbecue chicken. It's nice and soft and tasty and go through again two stages of grilling and then finished off in the oven for softness and also really bakes in that flavor. First thing you want to get, all right, <laughs> is either barbecue chicken or the pulled pork because again, it's like that's the first thing that everyone really, really, really wants. Being a police officer, when people call, you come. There's a sense of pride that your job is being appreciated. When it comes to getting here in the morning, there are some times where, yes, it's a labor of love. You're tired, but you know there are certain responsibilities that you have to take care of before you take that nap. <laughs>